Okay, uh, what I'd like to do is show you how to uh, solve um, this uh, quadratic with, um, with e. So it says e raised to the 2x minus 4 times e to the x minus 5. Um, so there's a couple problems that we can look at this. This seems pretty confusing. It looks like you're probably going to have to do some factoring for this problem. Um, there's one thing we can always do is substitution. You could say that e to the x equals x, all right? And then what we can do is just substitute those values in. Um, one thing also remember, if I did e to the x times e to the x, that would be equal e to, remember when you multiply numbers with exponents, you add the exponents. So that would be to the 2x. Well, anyways, let's just pretend, let's do substitution first and factor this so we can see it. So this could be x squared minus 4 times x, because I said e to the x equals x. So therefore, obviously, e to the 2x is um, x squared minus 5. So then to factor this problem, we'll have negative 5 and negative 4. What two numbers multiply to give you negative 5, but add to give you a negative 4, and that's going to be a negative 5 and a positive 1. So what I can do is, I can factor this as x minus 5 times x um, plus 1. Then from here, what I'll do is I'll resubstitute back in my e of x. I'm sorry, this uh, problem equals 0, I'm sorry, we're solving, right? So therefore, then at, or sorry, e to the x plus 1 equals 0, okay? So now we set each one of these equal to 0. So I say e to the x minus 5 equals 0, and e to the x plus 1 equals 0. So therefore, I have e to the x equals 5, and e to the x equals negative 1, all right? Well, think about this. e raised to any number is never, ever going to give you a negative 1. So therefore... That is not your solution to the function. And therefore, that would be your only answer, where e to the x is going to equal um, 5. And then, pretty much to solve for that, what we can say is we don't know e to, we need to solve for this, so we need to figure out what value of n. So what I can do is take the ln of, uh, I'm sorry, transfer this to uh, logarithmic form. So therefore, x equals ln of 5. And that's how you solve the answer. That's it.